I think about the first three and a half years when I was here, it was just a different school than what it is now. There were close to 300 arrests that year inside of the school building, um, hundreds of violent misconducts inside the building, which ranged from gang fights to um, just one-on-one -on -one fights to weapons. I remember literally standing in the middle of the hallway and I said, what did I get myself into? Most of the students disliked one another for no particular reason. Honestly, it was a scary place. Plainly, there was no culture. Everybody just came and did their own thing. It was kind of sad. You fast forward to where we are now, and I think the school has transformed. I think we're a model for restorative justice, for peer jury, for really trying to give students voice in the school community. The halls are totally different. The kids go to class. Like, I used to have a wall with tardy passes, and now I don't even do that because they hardly ever come tardy. Like, they get to class, and like, the standard has just changed. One thing that's great about our principal is that she's a hands-on approach principal. She's meeting with students, she's in the hallways, she's getting to the classroom, she's seeing what's going on. I think that that has helped the relationship build, not just with students, but even with staff. A person from Office of School Improvement had talked about NICFA Challenge and student voice. I was like, oh, okay, we'll just try this out. And it's evolved now into really kind of my right hand to really mold student voice and shape that and to give that like authority and power out into the community. The projects that we are doing, we're trying to do this thing called Peace Week, which is we celebrate at Finger a whole week for a whole week at school, peace. There's a lot more peace in the school. In fact, it's something that our entire community has embodied. So in fact, we have um, peace rallies regularly. We've uh, adopted a restorative justice practices as opposed to being more suspension oriented. We're, kick we're kicking kids out. We're trying to keep kids in school. I think our kids and staff are just amazing. I wish people really, I wish they knew that. I, I invite people in all the time, like, please, like, come, come see what we're doing, come see us. Ms. Principal Dozier had helped inspire us to become better because my freshman year, I wasn't really a good student, but she had actually gave me a chance and I had turned myself around. I want the children to realize the promise and possibility within their own lives and then act upon that and then have whatever future that they desire.